What's up guys, welcome to part number 5 of my tutorial videos for how to script multiplayer maps uh, missions for uh, your armor. So basically what we're going to start off today is we're going to, um, oops, nope, okay. So basically what we're going to do today is we will be, um, we will be uh, showing you how to put arsenal in. If you remember the last video I showed you how with Zeus and Ares how to put uh, arsenal into flagpoles and to you can adjust your equipment and all that so basically what you're going to do now uh, there's a couple ways you can do it i usually when i uh, when i put it arsenal i prefer to put it as a, a, a person so like it acts like a vendor but we're not nothing's going to cost any so uh, so i go to my first respawn as you can see here i go to my first response so just to make it easier so i don't have to walk half a mile to go there so i will go to number one and what I will do is I will double click and I will go uh, I will add a unit you can put this on um, you can put this on objects or anything I'm just gonna use a person like I said so I'm gonna go to men I'm gonna use a, a, a unit that doesn't have a weapon and let's just say usually there is an arm I think survivor is gonna be fine for this and here's the important part so what you're gonna do is in initialization this is where you're going to activate your uh, arsenal so here i'm going to just uh, paste what i have here and i'm going to explain it to you here so basically uh, the first one here is your line that which is going to activate your uh, arsenal so ammo box in it tr this true spawn this fm arsenal equal this equals zero so basically this is the code that's going to allow you to spawn your arsenal uh, the next code is, because sometimes uh, you never know what's going to happen close to, this allow damage false. So basically, this will, um, your character won't die if you shoot him or anything. And the last code here is disable, this disable AI animation or anim. So basically that's going to prevent him, he's not going to run away, he's not going to do all of that, he's going to stay exactly there, technically. So then after that, once you've done that, just put him down here we can rotate them anywhere we want and then from here we can do from here okay boom boom okay we will load into you can see we have our random guy standing in the middle hello sir how's it going today as you can see you can shoot him for half an hour and uh, nothing's gonna happen I know this is a taser but in editor taser actually does damage as you can see he won't move he won't do anything and he won't die all right as long as you go on him when you scroll wheel you got arsenal So if you want to let your friends and all that stuff choose what they what they want, you can basically go here, like I explained earlier. Same thing as the other one, as you put with Zeus, you can uh, select either. You can select here, and it's going to give you the options, or you can just select from the side here, whatever you want, and you can go through everything. Backpack, and then you just basically hit close and you see you're equipped there you go and it's that simple now one thing I would advise is um, unfortunately what happens is um, like I said uh, in the other video is when you choose arsenal and you choose a new weapon sometimes they won't like give you a like uh, here I'll just show you say I go here and I choose uh, basically an uh, AK-74. Bones. Take out my AK. And as you can see, it gives me two clips. Three clips with this one in the mag. So. Wow, this sounds horrible. Oh, it's got a silence on Oh, no, it doesn't. It just... And it gives you three clips. If you want your players more, but unfortunately you're going to have to 
unless unless somebody knows how to script it in. Quick quick little intermission here. I'm adding this part a little bit later uh, inside the video here because I've noticed something about uh, adding mag, which I've n I wasn't I noticed while I was editing the video. If you go into backpack here, actually over here, you can add mags over here, so you don't have to go through the entire. Uh, process of uh, being a crate or anything I have never noticed that so you can add them to your vests your in your suit uh, depending if you have the room for it so um, yeah so I'll keep the video will keep going and explain how you can do uh, put crate uh, ammo boxes down but for now yeah that's uh, that's how you can do it to add more mags without uh, creating the, the hassle so I've learned something while watching the video so now we're gonna go back to the video if you like I said you can always uh, message me in the comments below to tell me if there's a way to script it in but um, I usually just put an ammo box and a script in in the in the size Jason Phil to uh, like add cargo and add like um, uh, 20 clips of every of every freaking mags the basic mags that you can find um, of course in in the cargos which I'll explain in another video um, you can't um, like explained in the other video, you you can't. Uh, sorry, I haven't explained this. Uh, you can um, the video you you cannot put like um, vehicle uh, ammunitions in there, and um, you can get confused because there are a lot of varieties. So you might have to go into the website I put in the loadout video, where I, I give you the I, where where I gave you the link to the um, the site where with all the class name uh, class names for uh, clothing and weapons. Uh, you can find the ammunition there, which you can do this, uh, which I uh, do in custom gearbox. I'll show you into a later video. So arsenal, that's pretty much it for arsenal. Uh, there's nothing more where I, which I can show you with arsenal. It's pretty basic, uh, and of course, there's other way you can. I'm like I said, I'm not a professional scripter. There's other ways where you can create custom men, where you can script it all in and do select the weapons and loadouts or. Um, you can do like go to a vendor and just select cus either custom loadouts or uh, people can choose from a stockpile uh, and all those kind of things. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Please hit that like button if you did uh, and please subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed the channel. I will keep going with tutorials for now. Uh, the next tutorial will be how to, uh, as Arsenal, I'm going to show you how to put virtual uh, a virtual vehicle spawner which is a pre-made uh, script from a user which I'll find it in for you in the next video. So if you guys, if hopefully you guys enjoy, and I will see you guys in the next video.